Okay, again, we're in chapter 1.1, and we're just going to talk about a qualitative graph. And the difference between a qualitative graph and a quantitative graph is quantitative is just that. It's going to give you quantities. It's going to give you numbers. It's going to be fairly precise, at least as precise as we can be. Okay, and now I'm going to draw a qualitative graph, or draw an example of. Qualitative graph still requires axes. Of course, if I wasn't holding the camera in one hand, I'd be using my ruler to make very straight lines. And if my graph paper wasn't downstairs, I would be using it. Okay. Well, just like any other graph, a qualitative graph deserves to be labeled. So I'm going to label this time and distance. And of course, it's this is going to be. It's going to have to have a name too. Okay. And this is going to be the distance. I am from my house. Okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for a walk. Okay? I'm going to go for a walk from my house down to the park. Okay? And I'm going to show what happens over time. Okay? And this is going to be represent the distance I am from my house, and this is going to represent the time. Okay. So I start off, I'm kind of wanting to lose a little bit of weight, you know, get in shape a little bit, so I start off going kind of fast. And then I realize I really don't want to be going that fast. So I slow down a little bit. Okay. And then I see the coffee stop, sh the coffee shop, and I stop for a little latte. Okay. So in other words, my distance is no longer changing, but I'm having my coffee. And then I start to head down to the park again, going rather fast, and then I say, yeah, you know what, um, I'm going to go back home because I forgot my cell phone for some reason. So I go back home, and I go rather quickly back because I have to make this important phone call, and then I say, forget it, I'm going to drive. After I get my cell phone, then I drive and get there really quickly. And here's a representation of what just happened. Okay? I started off going fast, I slowed down a little bit, I stopped, went fast again, went all the way back so that my here, my distance I am from my house is zero, and then I got in the car and went really fast to the park. Okay, so that is a qualitative graph. Notice no numbers, not very precise, not very exact.